pages. I don't, want to, I don't know what to say. I'm tense because I'm not expected to come up today. Anyway, uh, the team is a great team. However, when 20 years ago I came to OU and I qualified this year for 20 years services at OU, and they gave me a watch. I felt like a reward. I never thought that wealth has anything to do with professorship. Wealth and professorship, they don't go along. They don't go together, you know. We just, we do good it, but we don't, we don't become wealthy. Till I met the team of the CCE government. <laughs> and two, I've known Ashley, I've known Blake, they were my students at the Mechanics of Materials. But they never told me I'm going to be a millionaire one day. <laughs> when I was chosen for that project, I was like, oh my God, more work this semester. But then, the first two, three weeks, some questions, and then dead silence. The money. Wow. No emails, no questions, no nothing. I'm your last, right? And then he one day, are you available? We can meet with you for a presentation. Yeah, one well, yeah. another week. And then he they came with a ten million dollars project. <laughs> Done. Executed, and I just was sitting there, and I said, "We're gonna be wet." <laughs> That's how much not the really excitement I would like to introduce and then tell you the story. I, I can't, I can't give them righteousness. Rachel, Greg, Alexander, and Greg. $70% and cost $80,000 per well. 
QGGMS can solve this problem by delivering more accurate mechanical rock properties and at a price much more competitive than that of the sonic logging tool. QGGMS uses only information from the triple combination logging suite and therefore bypasses the need to run the sonic logging tool. Information from each of these three logging tools is sent to the surface to a computer equipped with QGGMS, which exports mechanical rock properties at an accuracy of 90%. This increase in accuracy is due to the fact that QGGMS uses a very unique algorithm that our inventor has determined by use of the results of 20,000 cutting edge nano indentation tests and experiments. In addition, QGGMS can add an additional $130,000 of value to each and every well that it's applied to. This $130,000 breaks down to the $80,000 that QGGMS saves a production company in not having to run a logging tool, and then $50,000 $50, of additional profit that can be attributed to uh, increased production from increase in inefficiency of engineering design. QGGMS is fully developed and ready for use today. It has a copyright in place, but a patent, a method patent has been filed in order to increase the uh, protection of the intellectual property to the very unique algorithm that QGGMS uses in its estimations of mechanical rock properties. Now that you've heard a little bit about the value that QGGMS can deliver to the oil and gas industry, Alex is going to tell you more about the market that QGGMS can exist within. Thanks, Blake. The market potential for mechanical property interpretation software is $60 million. This figure was derived using a bottom-up approach based on the number of seats or individual users of mechanical property software worldwide. This is equivalent to 3,000 seats. Seat licensure is the industry standard for selling software to the end user, and one company can have upwards of 30 seats for one type of software. The number of seats is multiplied by the price for QGGMS per year, $20,000, to yield the market potential of $60 million per year. We are confident that QGGMS can take over this entire market, but we recommend a strategic entry point of horizontal drilling. Horizontal drilling makes up 45% of the market, or is $27 million. It's a very complex process that requires highly accurate mechanical properties in order to design an efficient well. As Blake mentioned earlier, QGGMS can provide this level of accuracy at a very low price. In addition, horizontal drilling will make up two-thirds of all of the growth in the oil and gas market in the next 10 years. This means that horizontal drilling will continue to be a strong part of this market and there will be a definite need for QGGMS. To reach this market, there are a couple of commercialization options available to QGGMS. In order to discuss these options, it's first necessary to understand the adoption process and the key players in the adoption of new oil and gas softwares. Exploration and production companies purchase their software from one of two types of distributors, oil and gas service companies or third-party oil and gas software companies. Independent interpretation softwares like QGGMS are packaged with a larger existing software owned by the distributor to create a comprehensive software suite that can handle all of the tasks involved in planning and execution of field development. This integration of many tasks into one software is becoming increasingly common and expected in the industry because of the advantages and convenience it provides to the end user. The most widely used of these software packages is Petrel, sold by Schlumberger. This encompasses 70% of the entire market. With this in mind, let's look at the commercialization options available to QGGMS. On one hand, QGGMS can be licensed to an oil and gas service company, which would then license it to an e &P company. The market reach of this service company would provide an early piece of the market to QGGMS. However, the licensing service company would retain part of the profits for each license sold and a yearly maintenance fee. On the other hand, QGGMS could be sold to an independent software company. Again, the established market reach of this company would be a benefit to QGGMS. But there's no guarantee that our software would integrate seamlessly with the other products sold by this company which would be a substantial disadvantage given the, given the increasing trend towards integration in this market. For this reason, we recommend licensing QGGMS to a service company, specifically Schlumberger, owner of Petrel. Schlumberger's commercialization vehicle for new specialized software is an online software store where QGGMS can be purchased, downloaded, and used seamlessly with the rest of the Petrel work stream. Brett will now explain this licensure and the implications in greater detail. Thanks, Alex. 
So Ocean is an online store where users of Slumberjay's widely used Petrel software package can download um, task-specific applications for the base Petrel workstation. The base Petrel workstation is a very large software suite that is used by exploration production companies for all of their software needs throughout the life of a well. These plugins or applications basically seek to fill in the gaps that Petrel misses. So QGGMS can exist alongside dozens of other applications on the Ocean Store as the first and only mechanical rock property software. These applications or plugins can be downloaded from the Ocean Store and integrated directly into the base Petrel workstation. This leads to simplified, integrated workflows that make it easy for data and analyses to flow seamlessly between the different applications in Petrel. This is what the industry is looking for, and this is where the industry is headed. So, QGGMS is a good fit with the Ocean Store for several reasons. First, QGGMS will have immediate access to 70% of the industry because 70% of exploration production companies use Petrel. Also, the Ocean Store is only one year old, but in that short time, two-thirds of super major exploration and production companies have already had significant experience both developing their own applications for Ocean and Petrel, and downloading third-party applications such as QGGMS from Ocean. Also, in this business strategy, OU would retain full control of the QGGMS software, whereas in a full license year, OU might lose some control. Both legally and functionally, the software still belongs to OU, and it can be taken off the Ocean Store, the price point can be changed, marketing can be done, or the development can be continued at our own discretion. The Ocean Store also has a reputation for rapid deployment of technology in the oil and gas software market. Case studies have shown that software can go from ideation through development to commercialization in one month. And finally, QGGMS can pay $25,000 per year to become a member of the Ocean Partner Program. This gives us the right to publish our software on the Ocean Store and also comes with the added benefit of support and resources from Slumberjay for both marketing and development. So we filled the gap from the developer to the exploration and production companies, the customer, with Slumberjay's Ocean Store. QGGMS can pay $25,000 per year to publish our software and make it available on the Ocean Store for download. At that point, an exploration and production company can download a one-year seat license of QGGMS for $20,000. If they would like the software for a second or third year, they have to pay that $20,000 each year. Slumberjay keeps 25% of the revenue per seat license of QGGMS sold and passes 75% of the revenue $15,000 back to QGGMS. So there is significant value to be seen for each player in this value chain. The customer sees the added value due to, increase, uh, due to the increase in production from better knowledge of mechanical rock properties on every well that QGGMS is used on. This is conservatively estimated at $300,000, which gives us a margin of $280,000 per seat license of QGGMS. Also, Slumberjay will see a margin of $5,000 per seat license sold of QGGMS, and QGGMS will see a margin of $5,000 per seat license sold. This is a low risk business model because after only two licenses are sold in a year, we have covered our costs and reached the break even point. So when all players are taken together, uh, the total value seen is $300,000. This is evidence of QGGMS's significant potential in this market. So with the help of the Ocean Store, QGGMS can enter this market both quickly and with minimal risk. And now, here's Rachel to tell you about our strategy for marketing and sales and the valuation of QGGMS. Thank you, Brett. In order to ensure sales, we have developed a push and pull marketing strategy. First, we will publish technical papers so that oil and gas companies will recognize the need that QGGMS is satisfying within the market. Next, we will attend various society of petroleum engineers, conferences, and society of petrophysicists and well off analyst conferences. Professionals are always looking for new ideas and breakthroughs at these conferences, and we are confident that this will be beneficial to QGGMS. Next, we will look to the knowledge, connections, and expertise of the Ocean's marketing and sales team. Their expertise will allow us to further market QGGMS and begin the sales of our technology. We will also offer free trial periods so that companies will be able to see, recognize how well QGGMS fits with their drilling processes before they invest in QGGMS. The time of these trial periods we will determine with Slumberjay. 
This marketing and sales strategy will lead to a 2.5% market share by the end of year one with 71 seats sold, and by the end of year five, we'll reach a 12.5% market share with 354 seats sold. This leads to projected net profits of $866,000 by the end of year one, and by the end of year five, $4.5 million net profit, which is a compounded annual growth rate of 27%, and leads us to capture a value of $4.8 million over a five-year period, assuming a 35% discount rate. This is also based on the assumption, again, that we will reach 12.5% of the market by the end of year five. Throughout our research this semester, we have created a series of steps necessary to fully commercialize PGVMS. These steps will take place within a two to four month period from start to finish and fall within three categories. Business development, marketing, and technology development. In phase one, we, will, we recommend to OU to form an LLC, which will serve as a virtual company and as the entity from which QGGMS will move to Slumberjay's Ocean Store, as the Ocean Store will deal with most of the operational aspect of QGGMS. We will also kick off our full marketing which we will be meeting, our team is meeting with oil and gas industry contacts in California at the end of June. And by phase two, we will be raising $25,000 from either the OU Coral Mechanics Institute or OU's Growth Fund, which will allow us to format QGGMS into the language of the trail. And finally, by phase three, we will launch QGGMS onto Slumberjay's Ocean Store and begin our push marketing, which involves working with Slumberjay's sales teams and offering the free trial period. In summary, QGGMS, QGGMS offers 90% accurate mechanical rock properties, which can lead to up to $130,000 added value per well. We are targeting a market that is large and valued $60 million, and we recommend to launch and market QGGMS through Slumberjay's Ocean Store. Through the Ocean Store, we will sell our product at a cost of $20,000 per seat to the consumer, and believe that we will capture a value of $4.8 million over a five-year period. At this time, we'd like to thank you for listening to our presentation, and we'd love to open up the floor to any questions that you may have. Yes. When you, you say you've got a, a $60 million target market, is that the that's the market for software in lieu of the sonic additional column? Right. Okay, so he's asking about the $60 million market and what that entails, whether it entails just software or anything else that it would include. The market that we looked at was using every mechanical property interpretation software that interprets any data from the sonic log or any other log that can be used to generate mechanical properties. And there are a wide range of those, from an Excel spreadsheet for one company to these huge complex suites that have other ways of calculating mechanical properties. And this market is all of those different types of mechanical property interpretation softwares. So do you anticipate getting, do you anticipate that market growing as people replace what they're doing with the cores with the software application? Is the market just going away from this sort of $80,000 drag, this in inefficient drag to a more efficient software model? Am I, yeah, am I getting that right? I'm sorry, can you repeat the question? I'm not trying sure, to Sure, I'm your sorry. It's probably a bad question. Um, is the market in general, it, it seemed to me that you've got the, uh, we saw the diagram of the two columns and the one column that was inefficient that cost $80,000 a year, sort of going away and being replaced by the software application. And, yes, sir. Um, so are people uh, over time going to go away from, from using that second sort of physical column to a software replacement? Yes, sir. As QDDMS begins to infiltrate the market, we hope that people will see that QGGMS is more accurate than the sonic log and any interpretation software that can go with it, and therefore begin excluding the sonic log from their purchases, and instead purchasing QGGMS to do those calculations with the other logs in the triple combo suite that played them. So you could be seeing a substantially larger market yes, than 60 in this type of in addition, in addition uh, the sonic logging tool is not expected to ever be completely re replaced by QGGMS. 
the sonic logging tool actually has other applications than just determining mechanical rock properties, uh, such as porosity and, and some other uh, formation characteristics. But a lot of this information is repeated information from the uh, from the information that you're already getting from the triple combination logging suite. And so the, the main function that uh, that the sonic logging tool is used for is mechanical rock properties. So it does come down to a preference of uh, each user, what, which tools they want to run, which one they feel is going to be the most efficient, the most accurate, but in strictly talking in the sense of mechanical rock properties, uh, this QGGMS does uh, do a better job in sonic logging and other Thanks. Yes, sir. How are you going And meeting with the contacts 
and you know, giving them, you know, telling them what our software does and how it benefits them with the use of the drug. Thank you guys.